So I'm on my Facebook page, and I'm not there very often, but I was today. And it says, hey, remember you did this five years ago or whatever? And I saw this quote by Marcus Tullius Cicero, and it said, a nation can survive its fools and even the ambitious, but it cannot survive treason from within. An enemy at the gates is less formidable, for he is known and carries his banner openly. But the traitor moves amongst those within the gate freely. His sly whispers rustling through all the alleys, heard in the very halls of government itself. For the traitor appears not a traitor. He speaks in accents familiar to his victims and he wears their faces and their arguments. He appeals to the baseness that lies deep in the hearts of all men. He rots the soul of a nation. He works secretly and unknown in the night to undermine the pillars of the city. He infects the body politics so that it can no longer resist. A murderer is less to fear. That applies right now more than any other time in the history of the United States of America. And 98% of the public is sound asleep too busy with themselves and the gathering of material to care that there is absolutely no future in the United States right now for your children whatsoever. It appears that the new world order is at the doors, in the doors, and now in the halls, and they're setting up shop. It appears that our generation, it appears that us, Right now, us will not make it to live out our lives as we planned, as our grandparents have before us. And certainly, our children have no hope other than to grow up in a satanic, evil empire and living as pawns and slaves. And that's just how it is. Richie from Boston.